Guys, you know me. You know I'm all about whatever's the newest, coolest, and trendiest thing that people tell me I need to be happy. For example, my Tamagotchi has been alive for 10 days so far. And I got a Beanie Baby last month that was retired this month, so guess what? I just made 30 bucks, baby. But I came to find out that not only do I need to have the coolest, newest, awesomest thing to be cool, I need to know all the coolest catchphrases. So here, I'll teach you the newest one I learned so that you can be as cool as me. It's called YOLO! What does YOLO mean? Well, it's not a yodel as I originally thought. It's not the sound you make immediately after a heart attack. And it didn't mean that I had to spend like 20 bucks on that overpriced yo-yo, which apparently I can't take back. YOLO is actually an acronym which means you only live once. And I know what you're thinking. Homeschooled? So does that- No, not you, you idiot. So when do I say YOLO? What if I say it the wrong way? Well, what if I say it in the wrong context? Don't worry, I studied a Twitter feed for like 10 seconds today. Basically, you can literally put YOLO at the end of anything, and all of a sudden what you said was super funny. Yeah, that's right, you don't even have to try to be funny anymore. There's a hashtag for that now. A phrase that immediately makes me funny? Where's the challenge? Why should I try that? It sounds risky. YOLO! <laughs> I am a comedy prodigy. That was seriously so funny when I just said YOLO. And then there are the people that are painfully aware of how boring their lives are and have decided the best way to cope with it is to look in the mirror and laugh at themselves. And the mirror is a metaphor for the internet. Getting two scoops of ice cream like a baller. YOLO. Eating high fructose corn syrup straight because I have a death wish. YOLO. Just bought a new kind of detergent. YOLO. And then there are the people that actually take YOLO kind of seriously. Like they write about all this awesome stuff they're doing, but it's usually not that awesome. It's usually just kind of lame or stupid. Getting so drunk right now. YOLO! Driving on the sidewalk. YOLO! Dude, last night was pure YOLO. Hello, 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 hello. You just have to ask me about it. And no one takes the bait and you're like, ha! Guess what? If you actually have to tell everyone that you're only living once, you're probably not. You're really just typing on your phone about a bunch of stupid stuff we seriously hope doesn't sound that cool to you. Oh, and also, you're not funny. Dude, we are going to the beach! YOLO! It's gonna be awesome! Are you what in? Is so YOLO about going to the beach? Because uh, I want to go, and because it's gonna be cray cray! Why is it gonna be crazy? What's crazy at the beach? Um, the fact that I'm gonna be drunk, and, and I'm gonna rent a jet ski, and I'm not gonna wear a life jacket! Well, okay, you know, not that I actually believe that you're gonna do anything that you just said, but I am because of YOLO! Have you ever heard of YODO? YODO? Like the green midget from Star Trek? Okay, you know what? <laughs> Okay, you're gonna take my card, and you're gonna go rent a jet ski, what? okay? You're gonna go rent it under one condition, all right? Okay. You have to promise me that when you're out drunk in the ocean on the jet ski that you will not have a life jacket on, okay? Dale! YOLO! <laughs> oh, you know what? Maybe that was wrong with me. But you know what? Yeah. YOLO is like my favorite phrase of all time! I could have put some serious input into this! <sighs> that makes me upset! <sighs>